And then anchor to your walk. Good. Get the connection through. That's better. To the trot. Good. So your transition's actually making more through, more connected. Now through the trot, change direction through the middle of the circle like a yin-yang sign. Thanks. He is being good. He's thankful to be home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Aren't we all? Yeah. <laughs> good. Now you've got to find the same throughness this way because obviously there's going to be a little bit of, um, he needs a little bit of <laughs> suppleness in this direction because you haven't trotted in this way. So where are the quarters going when you turn right? They're going out to the left. So be careful there. Put your right, your left leg back a little bit and guard those quarters. That's better. So the body bends around your right seat bone. Better. Watch the left leg again. There's even better. Relax your left arm a little bit. Yeah, good. Oh, yeah. Feel the difference there? Then he really came around. So you're just checking in with all your aids if they're helping or are they actually just hindering a little bit. Good. Now, through the bend, relaxing your left rein, your right left leg is back, you're going to walk. Just through your seat, relax the left rein. Yeah, good. Find the bend in the walk and then back up to the trot. Good. Yeah, good. Now, right away, find that bend. Think about a crescent shape around your right leg, around the right, through the outside of the body. That's better there. Get the crescent shape again. There we go. That's even better there. Every time it looks better, it's when the hindquarters stay in a little bit. It's not haunches in. It's just that they're not falling out. That's much better there. Good. To a walk and then back up to a trot. Oh, good job. Keep that crescent. There we go. Good. Good timing because he came up, then you waited. And then you asked again, and he was right. Good. Another change of direction through the middle of your circle. Different yin yang. I need to tell him the same thing. Right? Yeah, you do. Now, ride in your seat like you're going to walk. Yeah, good. And then trot on. Now, your seat will get a little quicker, so you'll go like you're going to walk, and then not quite walk, and then trot on. Yeah, so you get a couple of those quiet strides back to your trot. Yeah, and back to your trot. So you're using your seat bones in kind of a swinging motion, yeah, and back to your trot. Yeah, and just keep, work, keep working on your timing. Yeah, if you're a little slow, it's okay. Yeah, and then back. And so when he lingers, he almost wants to walk, then you keep the rhythm in your seat to the trot again. Does that make sense? Yeah, this is all little tests. Good, and then on and relaxing your arms. Good job. Yeah, and then relaxing your arms. Great job, really nice. Good, and then a little bit bigger now. A little bit bigger in your forward trot. And a little more. And a little more. Just see what you get. Good. Now, like you're going to walk, go all the way back. Yeah. All the way back. Even more. Relax your arms. Try and get it in your seat. Good. And then actually walk. direction through the middle and then we'll do this to the 